Hey y'all, it's Whitney. I am so, so excited to be sharing with you all today my new makeup storage solution. If you have been following me for a while, then you probably know that I have been looking for a new makeup solution of some sort for a long time. I just didn't know what I wanted it to be. And it's a good thing that I waited because I am sure that I just found the perfect makeup storage solution set for myself and I cannot wait to share it with you. So currently I am using three different 31 products and they all work really great. Um, and this is the main one that I use. This is the Glamour case. It's in a print. I don't even remember. Indigo ink, I think. Indigo diamonds maybe. Uh, and we do not have it anymore but I loved it so much. It was my first glamour case. I knew that I wanted a glamour case in like one of my favorite prints of all time. And this one was just darling. So I knew I wanted to get this. So this is the main one. This is the one that sits on my bathroom counter. Also, if you've been following a while, you probably know this, but Tim and I have the world's smallest bathroom ever. And we only have one. Uh, we moved into this house three years ago now. Um, and we were coming from t an apartment that had two really large, beautiful bathrooms. And now we have one tiny, tiny bathroom. Have you ever been on a cruise? That's how small our bathroom is. <laughs> we have no counter space, but this is what sits on the counter. I'm currently looking for a different vanity. So that will fix that problem. And it is always open and overflowing. Did you all see how that stuff was just ready to bust out? It's always overflowing. I can't even believe I had it zipped. Usually I have it open like this and then like this is sitting here on the counter. Tim is gonna be equally as happy about my new storage set as I am. So I have this for basically my everyday makeup. It's super unorganized right now because there's just not enough space. So it is a little bit more difficult to be organized whenever there is not enough space, right? So space is part of being organized. So you can e either downsize or set up a new solution. This is the Essentials Beauty Duo. It is much larger than the Glamour case. Let me zip this back up so you can see the size comparison. So it's much larger. Um, and then it also comes with an, another insert. So this will be good. I can't wait to figure out how I want to use that. I also got the Get Creative Zipper Pouch. I have the Glamour case the mini zipper pouch. So this is for lipsticks and glosses and some other things I just don't use as often. Let's start with the Get Creative zipper pouch because I know exactly how I want to use this. On the inside, I've never opened this before, so I'm so excited. On the inside, we have sections here. So we have a pocket in the back. We have, again, brand new, hadn't opened it yet. We have a zipper pouch PVC clear plastic pocket in the middle. And then we have pin holders right here, but I think that they're going to work fabulous for makeup brushes. So let's go ahead and get some of my makeup brushes out. First is my big flathead brush. Let's not judge on how dirty the brushes are or maybe even the makeup is. We're just solely talking about organizing, not cleaning products. have plenty of room for brushes and I still have an extra one. Found another brush. So let's put that in there with that. Okay, there we go. I like that. How do y'all think that looks? So all of my brushes and then a little corrector. Love, love how that is looking so far. I'm loving it. I'm going to um, organize my makeup by like what it is. Foundation, color correcting, tinted moisturizers, mascaras. I also have skincare um, in my same glamour case as my makeup. Again, I have limited counter space, so I'm hoping that that clear pouch that came with the Beauty Essentials Duo. It comes with this and that clear pouch. Uh, I think that I can put my skincare in there. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, 
I think I have everything set out um, and organized for the most part. Um, it's pretty funny now that I have it all set out. I'm like, gosh, that's, it's not even a lot. Let me see if I can tilt you all down to see it. And you can kind of see it now out in front of me um, a little bit better. It feels like a lot, but it really, it really is not a lot at all. But um, let's see what else I can fit in here since I have it open. I'm thinking a nail file would be great to just put in that back pocket. Um, I'm even thinking my eyeshadow palette will just sit in there really well. And y'all, this thing has so many uses. I'm just using it for my makeup because I know that's what I wanted to use it for. Um, I've seen crafters and scrapbookers use this for pens and pencils. Teachers, again, could use it for pens and pencils. I've seen knitting hooks in those holes, um, in those little pin pockets. So, so many different uses, but love this for my makeup. Okay. Now on to like the big kahua, right? So I have this and like I said, I think I want to put my skincare in this just because then it'll be easier to, um, if I want to go ahead and put it in here, um, I can, but if not, it'll be easy to grab. Um, this would also make a good travel bag. So if you're just going for a weekend and you know exactly what you want to take, you could put what you need in here, skincare and makeup alike, um, and it would be great for that. So this is the big one. It also does have a zipper pouch right here. I went ahead and I grabbed two other products that I already had. Um, they don't match. <laughs> so I'm going to have myself a party to be able to earn a charcoal get creative slim pouch and then a charcoal get creative rectangle pouch um, for free to go along with my makeup bundle. I'm gonna put my eyeshadows in here. And I love that I can see what I need so I'll just be able to look and grab the one out that I need. All that's left that is just sitting in the bottom is foundations, color corrected tinted moisturizers, stuff like that, that is big enough that it's not, I'm not digging for it. I can just see what I need and pull it right out. Okay, y'all, I think I finally got it all together. I had to move things around, see what I really liked, see what would be functional for me, and I'm so excited to share with you all the final outcome. So I have the Essentials Beauty Duo here. Again, this comes with two pieces. I'll show you the other one in a second. It's inside right now. And then I have the Get Creative Zipper Pouch. I love the personalization on both. You glow, girl. And, but first, makeup. So they're super fun. It's the peach personalization. Um, I think that they complement each other really well. And I'm just so excited to have this new set to use. Beauty Essentials Duo. It is quite large and it actually has two other pouches inside of here. So let's see what's in there. So unzip it. And then I have the other QVC pouch that comes with this. So these two, whenever you order the Beauty Essentials Duo, you will get both of these pieces and you can personalize it however you'd like, of course. So inside this, I have some primer, setting powder, um, concealer, and then some serum, and then my blending brushes, my beauty blenders. So I love this just to hold those things that sometimes whenever I'm doing a full face, I will use these products, but not every day. So I like that they're kind of out of the way, but they're there and easy to grab if I need them. Again, same thing with my eyeshadows. If I'm doing the full face, I have all of my eyeshadows ready and easy to use whenever I need them. This is separate. This is the Get Creative Rectangle Pouch and it's super versatile. I've used the same pouch for so many different things, but I definitely do have a charcoal Get Creative Rectangle Pouch um, on my wish list now to complete my set and have it all match because this one doesn't match. <laughs> but still super functional um, and it will work just great. And then on the actual inside of the Essentials Beauty big part. <laughs> um, I have my foundations. I have color correcting tinted moisturizer. Just some of my bigger pieces um, that I wouldn't have to dig for otherwise anyway because they're going to be easy to find. Love that for my new makeup holder. And then I actually think that this one, this is the Get Creative Zipper Pouch, um, will be easy just to kind of put behind my sink and use this for my everyday face 
usually my everyday face is really easy powder or color correcting tinted moisturizer and then mascara and I do my brow so my everyday face is really easy and I'm excited to say that this was probably the only thing that will have to sit out on my makeup counter so let's take a look at how I've organized some of my makeup tools with the get creative zipper pouch so when you first open it it has three different sections here so my first section I'm using for my brushes. So these are all the brushes that I have and they're all in one spot. I love the look of this and I love that it really makes me feel like a makeup professional. Then I have this QVC um, see-through plastic here for my eyeliner, um, eyebrow pencil, and some mascara. So all of my stick stick makeup and again uh, mascara and my brows are my go-to every day so this is really all I may need and then in the back I have other products that I don't use every day but I want them handy whenever I do want to use them so that is the get creative zipper pouch y'all I am so excited that I finally found a makeup storage solution set that is going to work for me I busted out of my glamour case months ago and I've been on the lookout and you all have been on the lookout for me even suggesting um, duos and other products and I knew that if I waited 31 would just come out with something that would make all of us very very happy so if you are like me and you are busting out of your little makeup bag, let's upgrade together and I can help you come up with a makeup storage solution set that will work for you. If you like what you saw, you can order any of this by clicking the links in the descriptions of this video. Stay up to date and to see all the other storage solution sets that I come up with for myself and my friends, you'll wanna make sure that you're following Whitney's Totes Adorbs on Pinterest, YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. I will chat with you all later. Thank you so much for being here. That is completely empty, so I'm not sure why I still have it. Go primates. I almost said primates. To stay up to date and see all the other solution storage. Solution storage.